What up, Pyro crew? I got a surprise for you. You remember this? So we got it built. Looking good. We built this about two months ago for our uh, last show and worked great during the show, but nothing blew up in the tube. So what I'm thinking is we'll take this out today and we're gonna blow it up. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. I can't really figure out any reason why this would logically happen if the manufacturer didn't put a, a lift charge in it. That would suck. I don't know any instances of where that's actually happened. Yeah, no. I'm going to load a shell in here upside down and hook it up with the firing system and we'll get back and uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, without further ado, let's go blow this thing up. Okay, so I put the end of the match right against that time fuse and the black powder slurry. I can't see any reason that's not gonna fire and then tape that up there. So we're gonna drop it in here, I'm trying to do this with one hand. Okay, so our shell is down in there. So we are set up to go. Three, two, one. We've got success here. Yeah, look at that. So it blew out the tube. It held up. Yeah. Did a good job. All right, well we're gonna we're gonna blow up some pumpkins here. So I'm gonna get back and let them finish the show. All right guys, I left the camera right here so when I got back I could film the results. And it's good. Uh let me show you. So the rack boat out here if you can see but uh, it pretty much stayed intact you can see these tubes right here uh, one's got a little dent in it but uh, otherwise they they held up really well this boat out the spacers broke off in there but ultimately the show can go on 